Father, you have put the wild waters in this moral land. The sky, I think, would pour down stinking pitch, but that the sea mountain to the Wilkins cheek dashes the fire out. I grew up in a bicultural uh, family, right? So my siblings, my family are hearing, so I'm used to being within the hearing environment. But to have professionals come together in the same space on equal terms, this is new for me. Um, I've always been behind, you know, in terms of accessing information and having incidental information accessed as well. And so this is my first experience and it's just been incredible to really see what it's like to be in full participation and collaboration. There is no really, Okay, hearing actors over here, deaf actors over there, it's just us. And so we're learning to communicate with our hearing counterparts and we're giving them some of our language as well and it's all working out. I think every time you're learning, you're learning something new, even if you've experienced it before, in different ways and from different kinds of teachers, uh, has been really, really thrilling. You know, I've been a student at, at college. I've been the only deaf student in my class. And so that has really had an impact on my understanding and my experience because I, I meet so many barriers and coming into this space, it's almost like I'm being revitalized. I'm, I'm giving, I've been given new energy. You know, there aren't as many barriers. There's lots of accessibility, all the sharing of information and the energy, and it just makes me thirst for more. So for me, it's the collaboration and the fact that everything is accessible.